Oh, hello, welcome to the new video. Um, today I'm doing uh, some classic horror uh, characters. Um, as always, I'm using uh, opaque black and white, and um, I'm using a tablet uh, as a surface. So first, um, I use the white for the layout, so that the character is oh, uh, like white in the face area, and then I'm using the opaque black, and um, so this is the second stencil, and I'm doing a full black. For preparation, um, I used a grinding pad and some uh, silicon remover, and I put a sticker over the camera. And then I um, used a um, uh, grey foundation, and afterwards a black one base coat, and then I can paint. So this is now the soot stencil. A dark grey. And uh, then there are two other stencils for the face area. And uh, each step you try to go a little bit lighter. So this is the last one in grey. And now there are uh, two, two white steps. Um, the first full white is in the cover-up stencil. So if you a look for, for the outline of the, the picture, you can have the perfect match for this stencil. So it doesn't happen that you have like the reflection of the eye um, not in the right place. So here are two stencils for a window. So it's a really easy step, but it really looks a lot complicated than before. So and finally, the the last white. And um, they will try to use less opacity, so um, try to use like 20-30% white. You can always put the stencil back on there and uh, make it more, but if it's too much, that's not good. So this is the first one. Hope you enjoyed. Bye.